Hello and welcome. My name is Mustakim Siddiqui. I am a hemonc hospitalist here at the Mayo Clinic in Rochester, Minnesota. I am co-author of a thought-provoking commentary titled The High Cost of Cancer Drugs and What We Can Do About It that will soon be published in the Mayo Clinic Proceedings. As you know, there is much discussion about the costs of health care in the United States. Compared to other wealthy nations, our expenditure on health care per person in the U.S is 50% higher than the next largest spender. In cancer care, there have been many new and exciting treatments that offer hope to those with cancer. Sadly, the benefit of these new drugs is typically short-lived, and many of these drugs are very expensive, ranging between $60,000 to more than $120,000 per year. Higher cancer drug costs affect patients in two major ways. First, through an increase in insurance premiums, so insurance companies can afford to pay for these drugs. And secondly, through higher out-of-pocket expenses. In the commentary, we examine factors that may explain why the cost of cancer drugs is high. From business models, to current legislation, to comparisons with other countries, we provide a general overview of these factors and suggest ways these could be addressed. The article is intended to be provocative and stimulate debate. We welcome all your comments and we look forward to receiving them. We hope you benefited from this presentation based on the content of Mayo Clinic Proceedings. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about Mayo Clinic Proceedings, visit our website at www.mayoclinicproceedings.org. There you will find additional videos on our YouTube channel and you can follow us on Twitter. For more information on healthcare at Mayo Clinic, please visit www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.